pick of Luigi. Uh, this might be because of a little bit of experience. Um, he actually brought Fyro down to uh, game three whenever he played about a year ago at ESB against his NAS. Oh, yeah. I remember that set. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where uh, Shears did the quote unquote double jump cancel with uh, jumping and immediately down being and dying. <laughs> um, he almost won. All he, he had to do was a simple edge guard. And he kills himself. And you know what happens. So yeah. he's probably looking to straighten that out here. Smart recovery again from Ray Chu. Ooh, I like oh, that. Yeah. Okay. So, you know, that's what you're going to be looking for the whole time uh, as as Luigi. You get those up airs. But sometimes... Oh, what a read. <laughs> sometimes you got you to gotta kind of get the damage on first because otherwise it doesn't really lead into anything. Well, one thing I noticed about playing Raychu is that he is incredibly good at reading, like, uh, where you want to jump away from him. And he's just so quick with that DJC to really attack those platforms that you think would otherwise be safe. Mm. Okay. But a uh, simple edge guard here from Shears. Yeah. Opts to go for an up air constantly. I, I didn't know that was a legitimate option, but... Yeah, I mean, I guess it doesn't really send Ness anywhere better, so... Um, <laughs> I'm sure other options would end sooner, uh, but really, <laughs> Jeez. Ooh, okay. So that's an interesting way to edge guard Luigi. Yeah, um, nice tech there. Uh, I think it might be because of the mechanic of Luigi only have one, having one coin, so it can't really uh, exchange anymore with that PK fire. Right. That makes sense. I, I hope to see more of it uh, as time moves on. It seems like it's a good option. Yeah, uh -huh. maybe uh, I'm sure we'll see a little bit more. That crazy down smash. And he had, he did not have his jump afterwards, so that, that was unfortunate for Shears. Um, oh. Ooh, and Shears had the right idea there, just a little slow. Yeah, and I do like the, the option to go for the up B there, because even if he didn't hit it, it's a very good. It's kind of a safe option if you hit it on shield, because you just go so far away right away. Especially in the middle of the stage, uh, you also have that safety net of landing on top plat. Right. And uh, Nessa's vertical movement, although we can go high, it can be a little slow with that uh, kind of drag from the initial part of the double jump. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we are at last dock here. Um, I don't think anyone has, either player has really shown a huge advantage. Yeah, they've been really kind of just trading back and forth, but uh, Shears just like trying to get out of the corner here, somehow rolls away. Oh, yeah, um, that's close. But yeah, just at such a dangerous per percent now. Just about anything from Raichu will put him at an edge guarding scenario. Let's see if we'll see that uh, PK fire again. Oh, there it is. Yes, we will. See, that's, that's, that's a good option. I think. Wait, so do you think he only can do that if Luigi throws out a fireball? Because uh, it he has to hit something of Luigi's, whether it's the up B or the fireball. So maybe so clever though. Yeah. So maybe Shears throwing out the fireball isn't a good option, but at the same time, you kind of have to to cover your your recovery. Yeah. So Shears might just have to kind of pick his poison here with what will be slightly better, you know? <laughs> yeah. Um, Lesser of two bad situations. Yes. Oh. Uh, unfortunate there. Uh, I think that can only happen on the left side. Mm. There's some weird stage stuff that goes on. Yeah. But so um, surprised Raichu wasn't more aware of that, maybe? Um, I don't, yeah. You can, uh, I think you can get that crazy bounce, though, you know, where you kind of float up after. OK, so Raichu, expecting that up B, uh, uses it to get that down air spike. And, and there it is again. Oh. Oh, but Shears knowing. Uh, like, good knowledge of him, just knowing that he could still snap ledge there. Yeah. That was definitely something that I would not have been prepared to know. Very good adjustment from him. Okay. That should be an up B. Yeah. yeah. Those up airs, man, they just lead into the just the juicy spot there. I love that. Yeah, and uh, that's what I really like about the Mario Bros. Uh, up airs. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> that was so cool. We're seeing some... Just deadly conversions from both these players. Like, each of their hits has a... Uh, Ooh, Raichu read that. Onto flat, yep. It's going to look for... Okay, I love that down smash. Just covering just about any of the tech rolls. Um, grab would have killed sooner, but Raichu is opting for, you know, the damage and the positioning over than the uh, guess of getting the kill. Yeah, I think Raichu is pretty confident in his ability to edge guard here. 
Um, it doesn't seem like Luigi has much as far as like tools go in, in, in regards to getting back to the stage, especially against this character. Yeah, um, I, th I think Luigi still has a pretty pretty solid recovery against Ness. Like, uh, it's slow enough to where you can be kind of picky with your options and methodical. Right. And I don't know. Maybe I'm just not entirely sure of... Ooh, interesting. I'm not entirely sure of uh, matchups when it comes to Ness, but is there any particular reason why he opted to go for Luigi instead of his, his Yoshi? Because I believe his Yoshi is really good. Um... With Yoshi against Ness, it's uh, I think it is a, a matchup that Yoshi can really work in, uh, but it's just dangerous because if you miss a double jump cancel on uh, Ness's up tilt, mm -hmm. Ness has great tools to carry uh, Yoshi off stage. Gotcha. Um, so probably just opting for more of the the gimmick.